Hey nerds, Sages here. So a lot of you were asking me, Sages, how do you become a Faytuber or Fire Emblem Heroes YouTuber? Well, I'm gonna walk you through some easy steps on how to do so, okay? So first up and foremost, for me, I use a tablet and that has an HDMI out and I just plug that into any sort of capture card. You know, Elgato, mine's an internal, and you just use that for most things. But you know what, it doesn't really matter, that's not what you need. That's not what you need. Instead, let's talk about some things you can use. So, let's go into the first step. Outside of that, of course, we have software. And for me, I use, well, OBS to record a lot of my footage, be it without my voice or with my voice. As you can see, it's moving right there, and also it looks like it's going into infinity. But this is what I use to record a lot of things. It's also what I use to stream as well. And this outputs this into an MP4 file that I can then put into a rendering program, much like Sony Vegas or anything else under the sun. However, that's not what we're here to talk about. What we're here to talk about is how to make simply the best content you can use when it comes to Fire Emblem Heroes. So let's let's just take it through the first other steps here, huh? All right, so the next thing you may be asking, as you can see right here, my tablet's not on, but you might be wondering, hey Sages, what do you do with that background? How do you work that in there? Well, it's pretty simple. You just add the image under you know, your screen in OBS, and you can really put anything here. I mean, you can put art from Fire Emblem, you can put a pattern that you find interesting, you can even put hentai as long as it's not, you know, too obvious. Yeah, just do that. The best ways to be a Fire Emblem YouTuber is, of course, to make a great build for a character. Or make a great character, as you can see right here, here is my proudest build. And what you're going to want to do with this proudest build that you have, is you're going to want to go, and you're going to want to go into Arena, and you're going to want to run Arena with this build, and it's just so simple, you just go in, and you, you know, you click Arena, and BAM! Off! You can also, of course, do unit reviews, you know, like looking at these units that you've made, some people send in some units, and you're like, wow, that's crazy, here's what my suggestions are for building a certain unit. I get this a lot, and it's definitely one of the best ways to interact with the community. However, you can also use this to trash any character you want and just make generally bad jokes about them. For instances, you can make fun of any sort of character that may be from Awakening or Fates, and if they're not wearing any clothing or you don't like their personality, don't worry, they're free game. Don't actually do this, please. Seriously, it's really, really bad. All right, hey, nerds. So here we are with the next portion of what you want to do when you become a Faytuber. The simplest thing you can do is, when it comes to videos that you're uploading, is make sure you have common courtesy. Make sure you name things properly. Make sure you're talking about what you're talking about in the video. And, uh, of course, here are some common practices you can do. So with the title, there's a lot of you can do. Personally, I find typing in all caps really helps get your point across, such as, holy crap, guys, uh, New Year's Corin is here. And, of course, make sure you're actually talking about New Year's Corin, you know, New Year's Corn in your video. And then from there, you just include things like, it's super easy to get. And then be like www dot you know where your website is and where you want it to go and all this other fun stuff make sure you have those links available to you and it's ready to go you know things like your twitter you know things like you know your discord stuff like that in case you really want to branch out and get more fans and then of course with tags you just kind of include things like you know the normal stuff like you're you know robin you know characters people like um hector um, Fjorm, I guess, and then also include things like, you know, um, things like, you know, things that will grab attention, that people oftentimes Google and want to, you know, look for. That way you'll know that you're aiming your content correctly at who you want to be. And that's pretty much all you really have to do when it comes to being a Fire Emblem YouTuber, is make sure you follow the rules, make sure you have a good layout, and, you know, if you can render out programs correctly, you don't really need to do that if you have OBS and you can do things in one shot. But, it really does help when you're a YouTuber and you need to make sure that you have the proper content. So, I hope this helps in how to figure out and how to be a better Faytuber. And follow these rules correctly and you will be super happy with what you got. Alright, so thanks guys for watching and I hope this helped out in some ways. See you all very soon.